Hey, it's Danny from Conscious Calisthenics here. So this was meant to be a one meal a day mukbang where we showed you us getting vegan pizza and then we decided to go to Veganery, which we're at now. But yeah, I ended up deleting some of the footage, tried recovering it with a program to get it back, but couldn't. So yeah, we'll just show you the short little mukbang at Veganery. <laughs> now we finally get to eat at Veganery and we've been waiting for all of this to arrive. So something started melting because it didn't all arrive at once. And yeah, do you want to share with them what you've got? I've got this quite a few times now and I love it. It's the banafi waffles with strawberry crumble ice cream. And then I got the soy caramel smoothie. Yeah, and um, what does that have in it exactly? I'm going to tell you in this menu quickly. I have no idea. It contains soy caramel, caramel syrup, soy meal, coconut whipped cream and granola. And I've got a banana chopped chip cake here, the strawberry crumble and the soy cream with some bananas. What are you doing? Just throwing the labels Seriously. on the floor. Um, and then I've got a mixed berry soy yogurt smoothie, which has got strawberries, blackberries, blueberries, banana, soy yogurt, coconut syrup, and coconut whipped cream, which is this lovely, lovely fish here. And then, I've also got this thing here, as you can see. And that is called a fabulous fruits and granola sundae got two scoops of the strawberry crumble ice cream, fresh fruits in it, granola, almonds, coconut whipped cream and strawberry sauce. And yeah, she convinced me I'd actually ordered this as well. And I was like, no, I haven't. She's like, yes, you have. And then he come along, she's like, yes, you have. And look. I was like, no, 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 no. And then I actually believed that I had done. And I was like, man, I've ordered too much. But yeah, I hadn't. It was all good. And something funny we find about this place, every time they bring out a dish out, they bring out more and more cutlery for every Brand single dish. But this time they've forgotten to give us food. They've just given us forks and knives. <laughs> thank you. Thank you. I know, it's okay, thank you. Yeah. Kitchen is closing. That's a really small spoon. It's perfect for me. Is it? Yeah. Let's put these labels on top. What? Wow, I don't know how you're meant to start. Mm. Oh my god. Mm -hmm. god it was problem with that? I don't know, I just, the other smoothies are like very, a lot more thicker. Mm -hmm. What does it actually taste like? You, you, you need to be certain what it tastes like. <laughs> just like, it tastes like caramel, creamy caramel. Is that what yours tasted like? Oh wow, that is divine. I know. I can see what she's saying though. It's still good though. It is quite um, watery, but not like it's been watered down. Which is not a big consistency, but oh my god. That's good. It tastes like a soy caramel latte to me. Yeah, like the ones you get at Starbucks. I've never had a soy la that's caramel what it latte, like. but. That's what it tastes like. Yeah, but that's. I know what a latte tastes like. Um, and soy and caramel. Yeah, that. Exactly like a frappuccino. Yeah. Mmm. I used to get frappuccinos from Starbucks, like the fruit flavored ones. No, it's exactly like the caramel. Mmm. Mmm. Wait a minute. I have any, and yeah, it does. Mm -hmm. But a healthier one. Man, they should make that into an ice cream like this. Mm -hmm. Yeah, this is really strong strawberry. 
really, really fruity, really creamy. And the strawberries seem to be bright. Ice cream is so cold. You can put too much in your mouth. No, not really. It's so sensitive. You're so sensitive. <laughs> oh my god. I'm actually in a music video on YouTube called Sensitive People. Really? Yeah. <laughs> Who made that? Where was this, that? It was at a festival that I went to, and at the time, the guy wasn't very like descriptive about what he was filming. He just said, hey, this guy came up to us and like, do you want to be like in her music video? And we're like, yeah, sure. And so we're like, there's like these scenes where we're just like dancing and the song, he's like doing a parody, he's just like making this funny song talking about how sensitive people are. And what yeah. festival was that? Symbiosis. Yeah. Yeah, I've heard of that. Yeah, nice. But like looking back, I didn't really understand at the time, but now looking at it now, I'm like, oh my god, that's me. <laughs> Everything. <laughs> that's funny. Since I went vegan, I'm very sensitive. I don't think they would have heard that. <clears throat> Since going vegan, very much more sensitive in a lot of ways. Your voice is very low. <laughs> Mine? <laughs> I can barely hear you. I just can't function right now. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, a lot it's of people aren't used to speaking with their voice amplified when being on camera. Like, mm -hmm. I always amplify my voice. I don't even think about it, I just do it. But I know it's a lot of other people do not do that. I'm just not used to it. Mm. First time we come out to put in ice cream, I weren't so keen on it. This time, it tastes way better. And the combination of all the fruit and the nuts and everything is divine. I think I got too much ice cream. Mm. <coughs> <laughs> She's falling in pieces. Yeah, this is way better than the eating mess that I had. And I'm enjoying this well much more than the pizza. Oh yeah. So much better. Mm. One down for this. Put the granola pretty much at the bottom. So it's just hardly any ice cream to eat with. So I'd rather they put it through out the ice cream. Yeah, I'm going to put the rest of the granola on here. Right. This is one thing I don't understand. I don't see in Thailand, but... Most, most of the strawberries white. Right, right. See, like a white color. Yeah. Like, just don't put them on there if they're not right. Right. Simple as that. Um, weird. Well, it's not even about it looks weird. It just, they're not going to taste good. Underripe strawberries are not good. Underripe strawberries, the berries in general in Thailand seem to be an issue with being fully ripe. I've not noticed it in England being like that at all. Have you noticed that in America or not? Um, it's just because they're shipped too far away, like California. They have California strawberries, and if they bought them, like if they ordered them too ripe, they would just go bad. It's not that though. Really? 
because I've even seen them at markets selling fresh mulberries and they sell them underripe. Mm. They seem to, in most berries, pick them underripe, even when they're under. Well, I can say at farmers markets, the strawberries are completely different quality. Like they're ripe. Yeah. And they're not. White. Well, I've, ne I've never seen any underripe in England, mm. no matter where you buy them from. It just seems to be a thing in Thailand. So yeah, that's one noun for this. That is going everywhere. Man, her thing has ruined mine. <laughs> this is a very fruity shake, quite liquidy as well. Um, probably because it's sitting there for a while, melting it. But yeah, that now makes this taste, like, it's not bad, it's good fruit. Frappe shaped thing. But, yeah, that's made it taste so good now. Yeah, that's Do you want to try and see what I mean? Yeah, I this had like an iciness to it, which is really nice, but this doesn't. Really strong fruit taste. Yeah. Not on mine, strong fruit. But I would have more um, soy milk in there or say it's not so fruity and sweet. Mm. I had too much like cream. Wow. Hers is just absolutely divine. That, three out of ten. That, 10 out of 10, yep. that is like, I'm not gonna say what it's like, that would sound really rude <laughs> in my head. But you got this one before, right? I know. Actually, I can say a less rude alternative. That is like making love to a sweet woman. That's how good that is. <laughs> what did you say? You got this before, right? Well, I said that I had, and then I was like, I'm not sure if I have. I'm trying it now. No, I haven't. Because I would have got that again. Mm. I don't like things. I'm not into coffee or anything like that, but that coffee taste to it, that latte. Mm. I don't think there's any no, there's not. Mm. I'm going to see what was in that again. That's definitely my favourite one, and I've tried all these different smoothies, frappes, milkshakes, but most of them. Yeah, I think it's the combination of the soy caramel syrup. Yep. The soy caramel and the caramel syrup with the soy milk, the combination is just... Mm. That is giving me brain freeze. <laughs> that is like really cold. Mm. Wow. Yeah, this needs to be so much more creamier, for sure. I think it's supposed to be like a, more like a smoothie. Well, I've had it before and it wasn't so fruity tasting like that. Before it's fruity tasting, but that's like warm. Um, yeah, definitely the other times they put it in, they definitely put a lot more soy yogurt in it. Because it doesn't seem like it has much in it now. Oh, sweet! Oh my god, she's mad. I'm so cool. That 
that is divine. And she's mighty fine. Of the eating up the vine and feeling the way it has to go. Eating from the vine and being in Dubai. Mm -hmm. Oh! My teeth are so sensitive. I don't know why. My diet is called the Restaurantarian diet. You can eat as many calories as you want, and restaurant food doesn't matter what it is, as long as it's vegan, and just one meal, you can say super slim and rip all year round. Mm. Oh. Oh. Now what? What's up? The of the ice cream it hurts my teeth. We got an epic mukbang coming up soon. We leave tomorrow. Um, so this is the last of our food benches here. And we're going to start eating a lot more healthier, more plant based whole foods. I'm actually really looking forward to that. But. <laughs> Not before the mukbang comes up. Oh, I've set up a mukbang with me, my friend Tiffany, Heinen, Notka, and, and someone else that eats properly. It's going to eat co and It's just a place that does the most amazing desserts in Copenhagen, yeah, which we've all wanted to go to for quite some time. It's just nice to get to meet all my amazing friends. And that makes me cringe, that noise on the, the spoon. It's like cardboard, so I'm touching cardboard. Don't do it! Oh, Jesus! <laughs> Please, you've always made me, you made me or swear then. Sorry. You didn't make me swear, but it made me, I swore because of that. Ah, oh. not like when people rub cardboard and like touch cardboard, it's horrible. I'm pages. So, yeah, that's going to be a fun adventure. This ice cream's completely melted. Yeah. What? Not anymore. What? I've reached the end. Best banana cakes I've ever eaten. Really? You're not trying any, you're too full. <laughs> hey! Violence! Don't you dare. Don't you dare. Please, no! <laughs> <laughs> never do a speed eating competition. I wouldn't try and eat so as quickly as I can. I do calorie challenges with certain things though. Oh my god, I think that was the thing I was going to get. I'm glad I didn't. Why? It just looks like too much. What is it? It's like 
it's like a lot of like chocolate brownie, chocolate. Um, Ice cream, cream. Yeah, like everything chocolate. Yeah. Death by Chocolate Sunday, I think it's called. Yeah. I'm glad that I didn't accidentally order the waffles. I like someone made me believe. Because usually you always order two scoops of ice cream, so I immediately thought that you ordered a waffle. I'm getting to my limit now. You said the other day because you ate too much. I'm never. I'm not eating tomorrow. <laughs> and I said, you wait. <laughs> you wait. I've said that before. Then it gets to tomorrow. You digest the food. You process it. You get hungry again. It feels like you're never gonna get hungry again. Well, right now it does. <laughs> then you fast around 24 hours and you're good to go. Yeah, you should do it one meal a day. Eat. Cup and cup. Check in. Crap. Meal. Cup and cup. They're cozy. <laughs> Kicking us out. What's he talking about? Oh. If you're still thinking about food after you've eaten your one meal, you have not eaten enough. Or if you're feeling, you feel hungry a few hours after you you keep thinking about food, you haven't eaten enough. Once I finish eating, I'm like, please don't show me any more food. I can't even look at food right now. <laughs> So would you normally eat this amount of food in a sitting when you're doing my meal? Fruit, no. No. Definitely not. You might not know, but would you say in the five days you've been eating one meal a day, you're noticing that you can eat more than what you'd normally be able to in one sitting? Can you say that again? You're not uh, projecting your voice enough. What did you say? <laughs> that since eating one meal a day, for about five days, you can now eat a lot more in one sitting than you normally could do. Oh. <laughs> can you hear me? <laughs> yes. I feel like I'm eating about the same amount. Really? Yeah. You said you never felt that full in like years or something the other day. Yeah, but I was I was not eating to the point of satiation. I was like going past that. When? When I ate a lot. When? I don't remember what day it was. Was it yesterday? Well, I didn't know if you met just recently or years ago. Um, I don't have to say an exact day. If you just mean just recently, that's cool. Yeah, normally I would not eat that much food in the sitting. I can't eat a little bit of banana in that. Yeah, I couldn't eat those two pieces. <laughs> I can't eat that. That's not enjoyable. Yeah. Oh. Do you want to eat this? My body's saying, please, no more sweetness. No, don't. I will throw up. No, I... <laughs> Oh my god, I'm a fart. It's so funny. 
that's the end. <laughs> I think the staff are enjoying it a lot. I was almost going to throw up then, please don't make me laugh. <laughs> I'm not laughing, I'm not laughing, I'm not laughing. <laughs> Please don't make me laugh, because I will throw up right now. <laughs> I need to compose myself. <laughs> Your shirt is clean. <laughs> yeah, can you paint them? Yes. Oh. <laughs> I don't know what I owe you. Just pay them with my money. Yeah, he had tissue up there. Come. Oh, that's better. <laughs> <laughs> Look at that, it's like shaving cream. Oh, this is such a mess. I forgot we're still filming. I've totally gone off track now. So, yeah, we're going to cut it there. Where? Now. So, yeah, that's the end of the vlog. If you like it, like it down below. If you've got any questions for us, leave them down below. Don't forget to share this with anyone you think might want to watch this <laughs> fun mud bang where it ended in chaos. Beautiful chaos. Um, and don't forget to subscribe to receive a lot more videos from me on a regular basis. And uh, make sure if you want to be notified when new videos are uploaded that you click the bell notification button next to the subscribe button. Otherwise YouTube will not notify you of when new videos are uploaded. Um, so yeah, as always, stay fit, stay energetic, and go get those games. Peace. <laughs>